Hey guys, Bilal here. Welcome back to another video and this is the comparison between the Honor 7X and the Samsung Galaxy A8 Plus. The Honor 7X costs around 13,000 rupees whereas the Galaxy A8 Plus costs 33,000 rupees which is a huge difference. Now here the question is that should you pay a double price of Honor 7X and buy the Galaxy A8 Plus? Well, let's find out in this video. But before we getting started, Visit Patel Mobile World and buy the Galaxy Note 8 and get 10,000 rupees cashback and 9,000 rupees cashback on the Galaxy S9 and S9 Plus and so many more. So what are you waiting for? Here the contact number is given. So make your deal now. Now come to the point and first of all the screen. So here both have 18 is to 9 aspect ratio screen with full HD plus resolution. The Galaxy A8 Plus has Super AMOLED screen with 1080 by 2220 pixel resolution. And the Honor 7X has IPS LCD screen with 1080 is to 2160p resolution. So the Galaxy A8 Plus is better in terms of screen quality and also the viewing angles are better in the Galaxy A8 Plus. So if you are looking for a very good display then you must go with the Samsung. Now let's take a physical overview. The Honor 7X has a metal body whereas the 8 Plus has aluminium body with glass on the back which looks shiny and it is up to you that which one do you like the most. The Samsung has done a great job by making the 8 Plus IP68 certified which means it is water and dust resistant which is not provided in the Honor 7X. So it seems that in terms of build quality the 8 Plus is better than the Honor 7X. The Galaxy 8 Plus allows you to use two SIMs and micro SD card at the same time whereas the Honor has hybrid SIM tray so you cannot use two SIMs and SD card at the same time in the Honor. So again here the Samsung Galaxy 8 Plus seems better than the Honor. Now the Samsung has emphasized on the selfie camera in the Galaxy 8 Plus this time. It is the dual lens camera, one with 16 megapixel and the second one is 8 megapixel sensor. On the other hand, the Honor has a single 8 megapixel sensor in the front. So let's see which one is better. And I have taken some pictures on both the devices with the front facing camera and the result looks better and sharper in the Samsung whereas the Honor is not that good because the picture quality is more darker and dull comparing with the Galaxy 8 Plus. Okay now these pictures are taken in very dark area with the display flash and once again Samsung has produced good quality because the camera lens on the Samsung captures enough light which helps it to produce better result. On the other hand, the Honor is not bad because it also has thrown almost enough light on the face and tried its best. But still comparing it with the Samsung, the Honor struggles a little bit. So here the front facing camera is better on the Samsung. Now these pictures are taken with the rear cameras in the artificial light and the quality is very nice on the Samsung because the colors are almost balanced and natural than the Honor. So in terms of rear camera, the Galaxy 8 Plus wins here. Now let's check the fingerprint sensors. And I have already registered my fingers in both the devices. So let's see which one is accurate and faster. One, two, three. Okay, so both the sensors have detected my fingers and unlocked the device accurately without any delay. So the fingerprint sensors are almost same in both the devices. There is not any complaint. Now both the devices have face ID. So let's check them out which one is better and faster. And I have already enrolled my face on both of them. So let's compare them. One, two, three. Oh, so here the sensor on the Samsung has recognized my face faster than the Honor. And each and every single time Samsung unlocks the device accurately. So the face ID is really nice in the Galaxy A8 Plus. Now let's compare the performance and let's start from the boot test. The Galaxy A8 Plus has Exynos 7885 processor whereas the Honor 7X has the Kirin 659 processor. So let's see which one is faster when it comes to the performance. And here you can see the Samsung has loaded the device first and the Honor has delayed here. So in terms of boot test, Samsung is winner. One thing I would like to say here is that the touch response of the Galaxy 8 Plus is very smooth and accurate as compared to the Honor 7X which is really nice. Now let's try some apps. First of all the settings. And the Samsung is first here. Now the gallery. And again the Samsung has loaded first and followed by the Honor. Ok let's try the Play Store. And this time Honor is first and delayed by the Samsung. Now the camera. And Samsung has loaded first. Now the phone app. The Honor is first here. Now the messaging app. 
and both are almost same but a little bit faster in the honor now let's try the google okay both are same here there is not any noticeable difference now the youtube and it came a little bit faster in the samsung and just followed by the honor okay now the gmail and almost same i didn't see which one was the first so let me know in the comments below okay now the google maps and it came first in the samsung and delayed by the honor now the facebook and let's see which comes first and the samsung has loaded first here and finally let's try the file manager and as you can see it came first in the honor and followed by the samsung so some apps are loaded first in the honor and some are loaded first in the samsung but the samsung seemed faster in terms of performance because most of the applications came first in the samsung so performance wise definitely samsung wins here so in the end of the video the samsung has better features as compared to the honor for instance the usb type c ip68 water and dust resistance super amoled screen very good picture quality the exynos 7885 octa-core processor the accurate face id and the smooth touch response so obviously the samsung is winner here but one thing i would like to say here is that if you buy the honor 7x then still you will get decent quality low budget smartphone and probably it won't let you down and one more thing is that instead of buying galaxy 8 plus you should buy the one plus 5t because it costs almost same as the galaxy 8 plus and it gives better specs and features than the galaxy 8 plus but it is up to you which one do you like the most if you are a samsung fan then the 8 plus is a good option for you and that's all thank you for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the video Hit the like button if you like this video and don't forget to subscribe this channel for more interesting videos. See you next time.